Welcome students to the first year of the GX Duel Academy. We hope to advance your skills in all forms of dueling. I've decided it is time to host the first Academy tournament. The participants who have decided to join this first endeavor are The Admiral delivers supplies to the school. He sometimes takes a booster pack as part of his payment. Alexis, like her brother, ranks high in Duel Academy. She is thinking of reworking her deck into a more ritual-focused deck. Alice was given a pass to leave with her family for a week trip in America. She found some cards and gave them away to some weird guy that came with her. Elisa is called the Ghost of Duel Academy. She is in class before the rest of her classmates and seems to hide in her room for the rest of the time. America believes Millie is the best way to win. He is here to prove it. Atticus has been seen flirting with girls from all around the school. Yasmin seems to be the girl he's been most interested in. Bailey has claimed she found her cards in a rocket. She says they talk and now about a certain boy and are trying to introduce her to Jaden. Eventually she will talk to him. Professor Banner teaches mythology. He explains where some of the organs of people's favorite monsters are from. Bastion is hoping he can find the true boss of his deck. There is a monster stronger than his water and fire dragons. Gerger found a good friend named Briere. He doesn't understand most cards but uses brute force to win his duels. Alaska was accepted to Duel Academy. He decided to give himself a challenge by giving up his normal deck to try a new weird fairy one. Blair, like all the other girls, are part of the Blue Academy. She prefers the color red and that's why she wears it. Briere found a good friend, Beauregard. We see one the other ones around the corner. Chaz was told his brothers were going to give him some new cards. Chaz is reluctant to use them. Chick was going to be part of the yellow dorm, but an error placed him in red. Good thing though, he found some rare cards on his way to the red dorm. Chumley doesn't like being on the island. He's missing his nice soft bed and can't get his father's famous hot sauce. Professor Crowley is the head teacher who teaches arts of combos. Each student gets one-on-one -on -one training to master their decks. Daigo is starting his school before transferring to Duel Academy. He thinks his school will just be as easy. Damon used to be unlucky and never draw what he needed. He has reversed his deck so he should draw all that he needs. Dimitri studied the winners of Battle City and found enough to build a Dark Magician deck. On the island, he also found a few rare cards hidden on the island. He even acts like an edgy kid. Murray says his deck is controlling him to do evil. People with dull spirits do not believe him. Professor Fonda teaches physical education. She is in charge of making sure the kids stay in shape. Harrington claims he should be in the blue dorm. He likes all sports but plays tennis most often. Ishiki doesn't believe in magic but thinks spellcasters are the coolest. Jane is excited to see all the different tools here. He's ready to get his game on. Jasmine was accepted in the same school as her best friends. Her deck is a hybrid of wind and water. Sato Kaibo arrived on the island with the students at Duel Academy. Jasmine calling himself Kaibo Man. Alice gave him some rare cards. Tommy loves two things, jewelry and fishing. On her free time, she is at the pier fishing. Gyo declined the blue dorm as he was offered and settled with the red so he can hang out with his sister, Midori. Ailey is a very bubbly person, saying she loves nature. She still screams when she sees bugs flying around the island. Logan is still learning the language, but seems to know enough to go to the school. People call him the Crocodile Hunter of Duel Academy. Lorenzo accidentally bleached all his fleet uniforms, so now they're all mostly white. He thinks he is the B-E-S-T. Madison has two personalities. He normally is a very loving person, but when she duels, she becomes ice cold. Marcel recently lost his arm in an accident. A few days ago, he woke up and found a monstrous arm, but the doctors do not know where it came from. Professor Mathematica is a teacher of math. He considers himself the most important teacher of Dole Academy. Professor Midori teaches Japanese. People need to at least be able to read cards with that play. We do not want people making up weird rules. Mindy used beasts that tend to inflict burn damage. She is glad her friends are able to join her in Duel Academy. Missy hates Rose because she pretends to be a princess. Missy says she is the only princess in Duel Academy. Mokuba heard a voice and when he followed it, he found a strange dragon. This light and darkness dragon is now in his deck. Natsuo hates Tess and tend to fail most of them. He carries a kunai in his pocket. He wants to be a ninja when he grows up. Professor Osa is a history teacher. He teaches how people use to duel in various civilizations. If it's on slabs, capsules, rose duels, there's many other styles. Princess Rose must be addressed as princess and will not acknowledge anything otherwise. She almost made it to the top of Battle City. Raizu sees Chaz as the future king of Duel Academy and will do his best to help Chaz any way he can. Reginald believes he has 
equipped car for every situation. He thinks he is going to get all the latest with his dueling skills. Rick barely was accepted into Duel Academy. He needs to work on both his dueling and grades or he won't get to the end of the year. Professor Ryuga teaches English. There are many foreigners that speak English to duel so they think teaching English should be mandatory. Ryota doesn't believe dual spirits exist. He still tells people not to wander around the island at night. Sam was accepted to Duel Academy. He's just waiting for someone to allow him to win with his flying elephants. Serena hoped her soldiers would have been able to come and join Duel Academy. She hopes they are smart enough to evolve their monarchs. Sartor is checked to Terriot cards and sees an army of darkness arriving soon. This darkness is looking for swords that will stop them and save the land. Professor c leads the science classes. Most people think it's useless, but science helps build combos. Seika roams the island and feeds the snakes. The snakes seem to recognize her and are excited when she is near. Serena Trinity was accepted into Duel Academy for all of her achievements. She just recovered from an eye surgery and learned how to play the game and entered Battle City in within a month. Chancellor Shepard is the head of Duel Academy. He is expecting the best in his students. He also hopes to teach them well. Shuga was accepted into Blue Dorm by Crowler recommendations, but he felt Red was better for him. Cyrus is smart and can pass any tests. He still gets nervous anytime he duels. He hopes to change this here. Mayu thinks the Blue Dorm is the only dorm that is important. He thinks that the others should just get spelled. Tori brought a Ouija board and wants to get the group together to use it. No one is accepting this offer. Tyranno is accepted for being put into the yellow door. He claims his dino DNA should put him straight to the top of the blue. Wisteria is trying to become a famous actress when she grows up. She uses two rituals to cause mayhem. Yasmin prefers the yellow uniform because her dad is a yellow dorm teacher. She's getting a little friendly with Atticus. Yusuke's spirit, Anas, has asked him to help Satorius and Soft of Darkness. Yusuke feels strange being around Satorius and Serena. Zachary was accepted into Duel Academy. He was to find a whole alphabet of light machines. Same police cyber dragons are the strongest cards there are. Here there are more cyber dragons, but they are a little bit more rare than the ones he has. You can find the tournament on Twitch July 14th, 1 p.m. MST.